How can you optimize your health in preparation for pregnancy? Let's explore five steps you can take when you're planning to get pregnant. If you have any chronic medical conditions, including diabetes, high blood pressure, thyroid conditions, or depression, it's important to meet with your primary care provider or obstetrician before becoming pregnant. It's vital to check that all medications or supplements you are taking are safe for pregnancy. Excellent management of diabetic blood sugars before you are pregnant is especially important for the normal fetal development in the first eight weeks of pregnancy. If you've had prior complications during pregnancies in the past, it's also important to discuss this ahead of time with your obstetrician, as there are often interventions that may help avoid these complications in future pregnancies. Preparing for pregnancy is an important time to reflect on alcohol, caffeine, or marijuana use. I recommend my patients wean down caffeine intake to less than a 12 ounce cup of coffee daily and eliminate alcohol and marijuana or drug use completely. This can be hard to do and I strongly encourage doing it before pregnancy as it may take some time to adjust. Most women will be tested to see if they are a carrier for cystic fibrosis or spinal muscular atrophy even without a family history. Take the time to review your family history with your relatives to find out if there's a known hereditary carrier in your family tree or that of your partner. If so, it's advisable to meet with a genetic counselor to discuss further screening tests prior to becoming pregnant. Pregnancy is a marathon and labor is a sprint at the end. Working to ensure that you are physically fit entering pregnancy will improve the health of the pregnancy, ease of delivery, and your postpartum recovery. Regular cardiovascular exercise can and should be continued during pregnancy, as well as most other kinds of exercise. If you are overweight, even a 10% reduction in your BMI can improve your pregnancy outcomes. I recommend minimizing environmental exposures in your home and work, such as mercury, lead, pesticides, air pollution, household cleaning products, plastics for food storage that include BPA, and infection risks, such as exposure to common childhood viruses. Women who start prenatal vitamins with folic acid at least one month prior to becoming pregnant have a reduced risk of nausea and vomiting during pregnancy. Additionally, folic acid supplementation of 400 micrograms daily is recommended for reduction of spinal cord malformation risk. The neural tube is forming in the first few months of pregnancy, so starting before you're actually pregnant helps make sure that your body is ready to support this important developmental time. Finally, checking that you are up to date on your vaccinations, such as MMR, or German measles, and varicella, or chickenpox, will help reduce the risk of these dangerous infections during your pregnancy. These vaccines cannot be given during pregnancy and should ideally be given at least one month prior to conception. Taking these steps will help you to be better prepared for the physical demands of pregnancy. Your doctor is here to support you on your journey to a healthy pregnancy and a healthy baby.